please welcome Keith Miller. How we doing, Manchester? Don't worry, I know what you're all thinking. When did the kid from Stuart Little get so fat and old? <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not actually him. He's doing far better than this, obviously. Now look, it is good to be here. I've been having a really, really rough time of it. It's been a really, really tough year. I don't know if any of you know how tough it's been for someone with this hair color this year. First of all, we had the Queen, and I know what you're thinking, an Irish guy, and look, don't get me wrong, I'm no royalist, I'm no monarchist, but personally, Lizzie was a bit of a hero to me. She was one of the first people to show me I could do anything I wanted. I could be the face of the stamps, I could be the face of the money. Then of course we had big Papa Schofield. That one was a bit more fucking personal, if I'm honest. <laughs> Whenever I used to feel bad about my hair, my friends and my family, they'd say, Keith, don't worry about it. Your hair is lovely. You're like Philip Schofield. <laughs> That's no longer the compliment it once was. <laughs> Although if I'm being honest, I'm not sure the full sentence, you're like a fat Philip Schofield, was ever that much of a compliment. And now we got Hugh Edwards. The man who used to tell you all the news, now he is the fucking news. <laughs> Although from an Irish point of view, it was great watching you all play the world's biggest game at Guess Who. <laughs> is it a man? <laughs> Duh. <laughs> Does he have gray hair? Obviously. Is he fucking dodgy? Yes! <laughs> but no, look, it, that's been, it's been a tough year. And look, with this hair color, you gotta be very, very careful about what clothes you wear. I'm a big football fan, and recently I bought myself an 80s style football jacket. I'll be honest with you, Manchester, don't boo, it was a Liverpool jacket. An 80s style Liverpool football jacket, and I thought it was the dog's bollocks. I thought it was amazing. I tried it on in the shop, and I thought, yeah, that's a bit of me. Bright white, bright red, bright yellow, bright grey running through it. I brought it home, and the minute my wife seen me in it, she said, ah, Keith, sorry, just to clarify, my wife is Scottish, she's not ill. But the minute she saw me and she said, ah, Keith, you know who you look like, didn't you? Now look, I'll be honest with you, when I bought the jacket, I didn't know who I fucking looked like. When I tried it on, I didn't know who I looked like. But the minute she said that to me, she didn't need to finish the sentence. I turned, I looked in the mirror for confirmation, and there he was staring back at me, Jimmy fucking Savile. <laughs> so I've had to give up the jacket, I've also had to give up cigars, string vests, and teenagers. <laughs> Giving up teenagers was particularly hard. I'm a, I'm a social care worker in an underage jail. <laughs> Basically, how that come about? I was unemployed, I was sitting at home. I was thinking, what could I do with my life? And then it came to me, Keith, you were really, really good at getting bullied in school. Why not make some money from that? So now I get paid to be abused by 16-year-olds all day. Shit, maybe I am like a fat Philip Schofield. <laughs> I do accept how I look is quite strange. I know that because every day people tell me, Keith, you look quite strange. I see it when I'm walking down the street, people are looking at me and they're, I can see them trying to figure it out like, fuck. Is he a really, really fresh 50? Or like, fuck. Is he a really, really rough 15? <laughs> like a 15 year old that's seen things. Like a Scottish 15. <laughs> I'm I'll, I'll tell you what happened. Basically at the age of 12, I hit puberty and my voice broke. And it broke hard. And then puberty swiftly stopped. No facial hair, no body hair, no nothing. It meant at the age of 13, I could phone in sick for myself into school. And at the age of 18, I could still get a kid's ticket at the local cinema. Win-win. <laughs> then at the age of 19, my hair started to go gray. And then very, very quickly, just like Michael Jackson after Thriller, it started to go white. <laughs> it means what I'm left with now, I got this really, really strange mixed look of a, of a face and a body. The top half of my head, I kind of look like a cool, funky, trendy old cool priest. <laughs> and the rest of me looks like the 15 year old he's trying to molest.
Like I said. <laughs> 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 Give it up for Keith Miller. <laughs> <laughs>